Good evening, everybody. The Kirksville football team will get a chance to play someone else Friday when they compete in the Blair Oaks Jamboree. Besides getting a chance to hit someone else, the Tigers are working on execution up front. Well, we're hopefully we can work uh, O-line and D-line, uh, work some formations, make sure we can get our bread and butters plays down. If last Friday night's scrimmage is any indication, the Ottumwa offense should be much more explosive as the Bulldogs scored 54 points. It's a big change from last year. I'm loving it. It's different than last year. More fun. I actually got to run the ball this year. And there's a lot more concepts in throwing the football. I'm more of a fast hitting person. I mean, I hit the holes faster than I get out of them. So I think it works a lot better. And Football is all about hitting, and over at Van Buren, that's what they're, that's what they're doing with a vengeance. Well, you, there's only so many things you can work on without pads, and it was nice to get pads yesterday. You know, it went about how I expected. You know, we did some conditioning, then, then uh, started doing some hitting drills, and, you know, it, it, they could struggle a little bit, but I think they were happy to put the pads back on. Over at Scotland County, the Tigers will be young at several positions, but regardless of age, it's a chance to get on the field on Friday nights. And they knew it coming in as soon as they got the job. You know, I hit the young guys letting them know, hey, we lost a lot of people and you're going to be expected to step in and play early. So they've accepted it. In college football, after a day off, Missouri returned to the practice field. The Tigers worked out for two and a half hours. The defense once again beat the offense cornerbacks EJ Gaines and Randy Ponder looked good. Ditto James Franklin and Marcus Lucas on offense. The Truman State volleyball team failed to make the NCAA tournament last year for the first time in 11 years, but there is no need to panic. The talent is there. They just need to tweak a few things. And really start to focus on the process of becoming better players and becoming the best players individually that we could, and through that process, elevating the game of the, of the teammates around us. In high school golf, Kirksville returns three starters, including Shade Shorten, who will tee it up in the number one position. I think it'll be great for her. Uh, she's comfortable in that leadership position, and uh, she's really a great encourager of her teammates and helping others understand the rules as well as um, staying confident in their game while they're on the course. 